Hello and welcome to my attempt at Let's Play of Sherlock Holmes vs Jack the Ripper. Will London's greatest fictional detective discover the identity of London's most infamous serial killer? Well, considering no one else has, I'm guessing the answer is no, but here we go. Uh, just a note, um, I do know about what happens in the first part of the game because, well, basically I tried to do this once before, but the volume on the microphone was too low. So, um, if I seem to know exactly what's going on, don't worry, I have not been struck with clairvoyance. It's just I've played it before. Oh well, let's plow on. I've only seen the first bit, so hopefully we'll find out who was Jack the Ripper. New game. A violin. <laughs> London. In the name so of dramatic. And yours, Holmes, stop smoking so much. There is more fog in our apartment than in I the do sun. wish you wouldn't smoke during. You are right, Watson, but this evening is never ending, and I have nothing to do but make smoke rings. Or play with myself. More using pastime would suit better, but my doctor is against it. Heroin is bad for you, you know, Holmes. Violin. My heart is not in it tonight, Watson. Have you noticed how this cigarette burns? Would you not say it is like a life being consumed? How many lives will end tonight in London? How many crimes will be committed within... Is Holmes having an existential crisis? Ah, the vanity of existence. It is but complaints and smoke, the meagre panache of its sickly soul. The tobacco is giving you very sombre thoughts. And very verbose thoughts as well. This inactivity will not last. Let's retire. You'll be in better humour tomorrow. And they now have to spell humour. Let's to bed. Ooh. Oh yes, Watson. I have much planned for you. Loading a church with some street names on the bottom. London. 1888. A den of inactivity and horror. Oh no, wait, that's 2000. Oh, you see what I did there. I'm not going to even finish that one. It's too bad. A new adventure of Sherlock Holmes. Sherlock Holmes versus Jack the Ripper. And you'll see on your left a slum and on your right a slum. And there's people asleep. Whitechapel, London. 31st of August, 1888. 3.20 a.m. Hang on, that clock says it looks like... That clock says about half two. That makes no sense. <laughs> Oh god, the camera's lurching over! Ah! Come this way, my lovely. We'll have a right good sign. Oh yeah! Wait, let me help you. Oh god, how many STDs does she oh, have? Oh, it's my hair that pleases you. How the fuck did you figure that out? <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> oh crap. That's not good. No, that's not how you get a blowjob, Jack, for the last time. Oh, lovely. This is one unsuccessful encyclopedia saleswoman. Ah, oh, she got blood all over my good knife. Now to flee. A great flasher of the night. <laughs> Baker Street, September the first, eighteen eighty-eight, two thirty-five p.m. The news is as dark as the sky, Holmes. An inquest has been opened into the murder of a poor woman in the East End. One of many. The unfortunate girl was discovered last night, lying in the street, still warm. Still warm, you the say? The murderer was filled with an incredible savagery. He oh, supported Manchester United. Down my spine. 
The inspectors in charge of the case don't seem to have even the slightest lead. A similar murder took place less than a month ago. Why are there a bunch ah, of bullet no. holes in the wall? A romantic walk, a kiss in the moonlight, a polite refusal, a terrible anger, and a hanging. And they say this romance is dead. This is a disgrace to London. The government should take serious note of what is going on there. Whitechapel? This woman was found in Whitechapel? Yes, indeed. Bucks Row, to be specific. Oh god, not Bucks Row! ...of romance, but of commerce. You don't think they can be interlinked? ...take pleasure in the vice. The female nature is completely... Holmes, do you hear yourself? A woman is dead under unspeakable circumstances. Which is why I just spoke them. No less than any other. She was a human. And one of Her Majesty's subjects. If she hadn't been Her Majesty's subject, then it would have just been another murder. Survive, but by selling their bodies, you know as well as I that our era is not a gentle one, and these women don't have much to look forward to. Except a good hard Some dicking. Grace, if you would, do not refuse them your compassion. Do not say another word, my dear Watson. We shall leave. We them don't want to have to punish you again, do we? Of the crime. No, I think it would be better to arrive there a bit later once night has fallen. So we can and look like illegal people. By police officers and spectators, it would be impossible to investigate properly. Then where are we going, Holmes? The best We're going on a little walk. Is head to the police station and attempt to get a copy of the preliminary reports. By the theft. The time seem quite complete to me. You must know, Watson, that journalists often draw conclusions from the facts without a proper understanding. What? Do this journalists can sometimes make up facts or over-exaggerate? Holmes, Holmes, what kind of God. madness has overtaken Very you well, today? Holmes, but all the same. It seems to me that I have a map of London somewhere, Watson. Can you find it and locate Whitechapel while I get ready? Hmm. You are too kind, Holmes. Searching through your mess? Do I have to discipline you again, Watson? I will next time you back chat. Yeah, special edition of the White Ch Special edition, the Whitechapel Horror, the third crime of a man who must be a maniac. Oh god, it's good to see that Holmes is right on the case. The fact that this is the third one. First person perspective. Third person's perspective. See, you can just click. And double click and he runs. Good. In this game you can change it. Press the R button on. Or the middle mouse button just. Oh, I see. Do 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 do. A violin. His violin. He doesn't play nearly enough if you ask me. He's such a beautiful man. Why doesn't he just kiss me? I have no reason to go that way. Oh, Holmes is cap. Let me just spin it. Oh. Oh, and his umbrella. Oh, the things I could do. Oh, nurse. Sorry. Uh, 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 the the map. Yes. The, the um, fireplace. This is how Holmes stores his post. Thank goodness his clients don't see this. It would be a disgrace. For a dynamic help and see all accessible items. Oh, I see. Right. Now, time to start the game. I see. This is the harpoon that pierced the sailor Peter the Black. Bizarre little relic. Hmm. Odd, yes. What's this? Switzerland. A charming country. Perhaps Holmes and I shall investigate one day. Ah, the Reichenbach Falls. I remember them well. Colonel Gordon. During the last adventure of the resident patient. Holmes uses this old Persian slipper to hold his pipe tobacco. I've heard of worse what uses for it. The fire. This was due to the case of the X and Y. I don't know anymore. Shut up. Uh, Treaty case. on Cornish, the Celtic dialect of Cornwall, and here medieval pottery. How can Holmes possibly read such things? I mean, I can understand medieval pot pottery is completely relevant, but learning about the Cornish, <laughs> crazy talk. Holmes's experiment table. Where's my dog? Nothing much going on out here. Oh, the camera's swaying about drunkenly. Well, well. Holmes <laughs> has received some French champagne. French champagne. With a card. A gift from a young admirer. Signed, Raoul Dandressy. Who on earth could that be? Ooh, Holmes. Your admirer fills Watson with a raging jealousy. There's the map. But is there anything else we can look on first? Oh, there's something down here. 
This is the coal bucket in which Holmes keeps his cigars. What a funny idea. <laughs> funny, yes. <laughs> Hilarious. Uh, looked at everything over there. Stuff over here still to look at. Uh. <laughs> the adventure of the dancing men. I remember it well. Oh, they were they were doing all sorts of things. The the conga, the the Charleston, and even worse, freestyle disco. Oh, the terror. The Queen's initials done in bullet holes. Good old Holmes. Ah, so that's what the bullet holes are. Victoria Regina. If you'd done Victoria Saxacoba Gotha, it would have probably taken a while. Uh, everything that can be clicked on has been clicked on, so let's pick up... No, let's first do this. Let me in! Have you found the map of London, Watson? Come, my friend, it can't be too far. Be sure to locate the police station in Whitechapel we must get to. Understood, Holmes. Yes, Holmes. Uh, sorry I was trying to enter your room. I don't know what came over me. The map, the map. It's somewhere around here. Oh, it's, this is the one with the big hand the over it. Map of London. At last. Let's see. The district is it weird Whitechapel. that they, they must have lived in London for years and they don't know where Whitechapel is? Of course, not to assume that either Watson or Holmes would <coughs> visit such a place, but you never know. Whitechapel. Oh yes, there's the police I found station. The map, Holmes, and I was able to locate the Whitechapel police station. Well done, Watson. Do you want a biscuit? Come, the game is afoot. You can read the article to me on the way. 